exciting. It's a lot of fun. It's extremely physically demanding. It's a super fun event and there's always lots of interesting things to see and it's always good to come every year. I feel really pumped. I'm going to do all I can to make this the best art we could possibly make. Um, we have competed twice actually. This is our third time competing, Ravella and I. and. Um, so that has been really, really helpful in teaching us how to do the correct technique and how to assemble a design that is good for the judges and what the judges will like. The theme was artsy bugs, and so I came up with the idea that we should do something with a scarab beetle and the art of the ancient Egyptians. And so then we then came up with a actual finalized design for the composition. And now we are working on laying out the colors, making sure it's right, making sure we have correct placement, um, and making sure we just get everything as true to our original design as possible. Going to an event like this is really important because it teaches you about competition and it shows you what's out there that you need to be joining in on in the art. It just teaches you about competition and working with others and how to make an art image to please someone else. Well, you know, ArtFest really in itself is such a great event, and the fact that we have the opportunity to do this chalk art, it's just a really fantastic, it's a fantastic experience, and just doing a wide, uh, you know, a large mural just helps. Uh, we get to display our design abilities, our abilities to color, and, um, you know, it's just really fun overall and messy. So, <laughs> um, well, again, like Ellie said, this is the third year she and I have done it. Um, so we're sort of experienced. We know what the judges look for and what they like. Uh, this time around, we're doing a 3D type bug coming out of the pavement. The past four years have really been just really intensive in design and color and just the fundamentals. Um, and so now we really get the opportunity to display them to the public. Um, so, you know, it's really nice. Well, I think this is one of those rare moments where kids can come together, cooperatively make art, and uh, spend all day enjoying an event that they may never get to do as they become adults. So I think this is a rare opportunity that, that they'll always remember. Basically, I looked at students that were patient, that were energetic about getting outside, not afraid to get dirty, um, wanted to have fun, do something artsy for the day. So uh, overall, just to have a nice time. And I found lots of them, but uh, it was a hard pick. But the ones I picked, I'm glad I picked them and they're doing a fabulous job. Uh, nine students total, and hopefully we'll have more teams next year. They met over a month's period of time. They came together as a group. They designed their sidewalk chalk uh, images as a team. And then they practiced at the center uh, different tricks, techniques, so that they be could become more confident during today's um, festival. They learn a lot about value. To be successful in this particular competition, it's all about color and value. So the elements are key. It's all about going back in, refining, refining, refining. And if their blending is even a little off, everything will muddy together, where the colors will actually combine and then create almost like a dirt-like appearance. So they have to be very careful not to blend everything together, keep the colors separate, and therefore vibrant. Soft pastel chalk, you can buy it anywhere in an art store. And um, I think for a lot of them, this was a first-time experience handling the medium. and. Uh, you just look over and they're smiling away, they're completely covered, head to toe, in shock, and um, I, think, I think they're enjoying themselves. Our freshman team is the youngest and they're doing a fabulous job, and my goal is to have them continue each grade level until they graduate. So they, they'll find that they'll become better and better every year just from the simple practice. I think competitions in general that come up throughout the year are so vital for students to get involved in. It builds confidence, it builds community, and I think overall it's just a great way to spend a day.